Whoever created this universe must be all knowing, must be all powerful, cannot be like onto his creation, doesn't have a beginning, doesn't have an end. Therefore, we should worship him alone uh, and we should not ascribe any partners with him. And the one sin that is unforgivable in Islam is shirk, which is associating partners with Allah, with God. Because the Quran mentions in chapter 4, verse 48, and chapter 4, verse 116, that Allah does not forgive the sin of associating partners with Him, but He can forgive any other sins. And I think this also resonates with Christianity to a certain extent, because for my natural inclination, based on my based upon the universal knowledge, I cannot, I cannot give the same qualities of of Allah's of God's creation to God. So anything else besides the Creator is not worth to be worshipped. So. Even Muhammad is not worthy to be worthy to be worshipped. Why? Because he's a human being like us. He, you know, he depends upon Allah. He has to pray to Allah. So why is he worthy to be worshipped? Similarly, Jesus Christ, peace be upon him, he used to eat just like us. And God does not require to eat. Do you agree with that? Yeah, in, yeah. in the spirit. In the spirit. But even, I, 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 think yeah. you, I don't think I don't think you can you can put uh, Allah or Yahweh in a box. He can do whatever he wants. He, when you say he could do, what, but we're not talking about his will right now. We're talking about his nature. So God, by definition, is all powerful. Do you agree with that? Okay. But when we analyze any human being, any any of God's creation, whether it's humans, whether it's animals, whether it's trees, they're not all powerful. Right? They have deficiencies, they have, they have weakness, for, including, including Jesus, including Muhammad, including all the human beings like us. Yeah? So why should, we then, why should we then ascribe partners with the all-powerful being with somebody who is not all-powerful? See, I don't need Islam and I don't need Christianity to tell me who deserves to be worshipped. So, so if you look at the qualities of Jesus, he was a human being like us, he wasn't all-powerful. Well, yeah. I would say he was both man and God. He, okay. called him, he called himself the Son of God. That's the title he gave himself. So I'm happy with that. Okay. I, I mean, I, 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 you are entitled to your own opinion, and I'm entitled to your own opinion, of and we just want to have a mutual discussion. Yeah. What you're talking about is the the two one, the one two God, natures. One God. I don't have a problem okay. there being one God. Can we come to a common agreement that? There is only one God. That, 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 that's something that we can come to a common agreement. But however, however, are we actually worshipping? See, we acknowledge this one God, but in your concept, I don't believe that you believe in one God. I believe, I believe that you are subscribing to something called a family of God. Because, do, do, do you, are you a Trinitarian? Do you believe in the concept of Trinity? I read in the Bible that John the Baptist says, yeah. this is the Lamb of God. The Holy, he sees the Holy Spirit descend on Jesus and then a voice from the heavens says, this is my son, you know, whom I am pleased with. So there are three things going on there. Some people call it the Trinity. That's up to them. But there are three things, however you want to describe them. I understand where you're coming from, David. But let's not talk about Islam and Christianity right now. Let's not talk about Islam and Christianity. Why Let's talk it, about... Why is it that all the wars in the world and perpetuated by your belief in a certain God? They're not. They are. They're not. That... Ireland, Catholics, Protestants, Islam... Communism. Fucking communism. Yeah, they Anything don't believe in God. Do, it's all regarded around religion. It's not God though. No, do you, you want to engage with them or do, the or do you want to believe in their religion? It's up to you. I mean, kill people for their so called God, their own particular God. Islam's got a God they believe in violence. Sir, Christians believe in God. Yeah. They cut up people's heads because they don't believe in their God. <laughs> That's with the presupposition that you do believe in God. Sorry? No. That's with the presupposition that you do believe no. in God. I'm an atheist, but I tell you what, I'm an atheist, but I do very good work for Christian people. David, do you want to do you want to have a discussion? I donate one to one, or I donate money yeah. to. It's up to you, up to you. I mean, if you want him to give. Well, we were having a conversation, but stay there. Sorry, 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 sorry. sorry. Stay there. I thought you were doing. No, but I can have, we can have a separate yeah, discussion. Yeah, yeah. I can have a separate discussion with you. No problem. No problem. I do I do Christian things, but I don't believe in a God. No problem. You have Christian values, but you don't believe in God. No, but, yeah. Values. I okay. help somebody out. 
pressure you in a, yeah. in a problem, I will help you out and I'll try and Absolutely. do what you can. Absolutely. Don't go to church and pray to your God. Yeah. Can, what's your name, sorry? Paul. 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 My name's Rahan. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You're David. I think well, my, I, so are you, David. <laughs> I think myself and David, if we can come to a mutual agreement, uh, myself and David, as you know, we, we had like a, a discussion. Yes, I know. Um, with our mutual agreement, do you want him to be to 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 to, to contribute to our discussion, or do you want strictly just between no, us two? Yeah. No problem. But I can I can have a separate discussion with you. No problem. You can listen. You can listen. But do, but do you want him to contribute or? That's fine. Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't believe in this, in this Bible thing where man was... We're the Trinity. Yeah, <laughs> the trio. Well, <laughs> where man was created from a, an arm or a bone, an Eve. That's a lot of theory. That's a lot of, I believe in yeah. the amoeba, this amoeba, the stage of amoeba through billions of years. Paul, God, I, wasn't, God wasn't involved I'm, in that. I'm more, than, I'm more than happy to discuss with you separately. I mean, I think, you, I think this gentleman here needs to go soon, isn't it? So. I can I definitely. I, oh, you got to go. Okay, cool. But, a long walk back to the main but yeah. do, do you want us to uh, carry on with the discussion or? Is it filming then? It is filming. I mean, if you. Yeah, carry on, carry on. Yeah, sure. Okay, cool. <laughs> I just believe my concept is. My, my basic thing is. My basic thing is. My basic thing is. If anyone believes in the animal. It's on Netflix. They're all fighting each other. Oh, thank you, Paul. Thank you, Paul. I think a lot of um, there's a lot of lot of uh, conflicts around the world have been no. religion has been blamed for, but there's normally another agenda. Going of course, I agree excuse, with that. It's probably excuse they're using. But anyway, the can we? Can we? Economics is a big one. You know, we want yeah. you've got. We'll, we'll, we'll have a war on this yeah. percent so we can get your land. Well, yeah, in the eighth, when you said no, I don't want Catholics. I want you to Well, he was a bit of a lad, wasn't he? I'm, 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 I'm more than, I'm more than happy to discuss with. You. I mean, I'm going to be here till, till seven or eight p.m. So I'm, I'm, I'm here in the park. So if you want, we can, we can have a one-to-one -one discussion, and no one will, will interview. Yeah, it's brilliant. Absolutely. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I really, I really appreciate your, 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 your contribution, but I think between myself and. Hmm? Doesn't help you. Oh, he doesn't, doesn't help me. <laughs> Fair enough. That's that's your opinion. But if, if if myself and David, I mean, do you want to carry on with discussion? One of you? Sure, no problem. So, but you can listen. No problem. No problem. So I, right now, I don't want to talk about Islamic Christianity, even Islamic Christianity, right? From your natural state, do you believe that there is God? Let's go back to the basics. Do I believe all this was by chance? No. Good. There must be another higher no. order. So what qualities and attributes would you ascribe to the Creator? He's very good at making things. Okay. Okay. And he's drawing them. Well, I mean, for example, now that we have the science, uh, the, hu the cell, the cell is a massively complicated structure. Sure, sure. Um, that, that, that is very finely tuned and uh, it's, a, it's a miracle. And so there must be some intelligence behind it. It can't be just be. It can't just have happened. One hundred percent. You have to have more faith than I've got in Christ. So I do believe there's a higher. I'm reading okay. that book, Arrival of the Fittest. And so what else? What else would you? And I, I one hundred percent, I agree everything that you said. Like even the even the a single cell, you know, it contains more information than the whole like British Library, right? So there must be intelligence. I agree with you. But apart from that, what attributes would you? Would you give to it apart from the fact that he's he's the creator? Does he possess knowledge? Well, I don't need to know. Actually, I don't need to know. Why not? Everything about him. No, I'm not saying everything you know about him. But from the first principle, we both we both believe that there is there must be the creator, right? So this creator, would you say, must be more, must be more powerful than anything that's in the creation? Can we agree on that? If he wants it to be that way, it'll yeah. be that way. Yeah. I don't. I don't think he's. I don't think he's a an angry. Yeah. You know. Uh, I, I agree. Uh, what's, what's the word? An, an angry, Ang a wrath. Um, uh, a bit like the Pharisees when they were very. Uh, you know, look at me. Yeah. He's not trying to make a name for himself. He is who he is. Okay. Full stop. And so, 
he made me and you and everything here. Yeah. And so he must have an intelligence. Brilliant. So would you say would, would you say that the, the creator In that, our understanding. that yeah would you say that the creator that we acknowledge is all knowing? Must be all knowing. Can't be like his creation because uh, because like us, as well as the animal kingdom, the humans. They're not all knowing, correct? We're not all knowing, we're ignorant. He's the only one who does know. Yeah, so he must be perfect. He knows what's going to happen in the next half an hour. Exactly. I don't. I don't. Exactly. So, so we, we're both coming to a common agreement. Would you say that God is perfect in all of his attributes? In his knowledge, in his wisdom, in his power? Whereas his creation, like us, and the animal kingdom is imperfect. Would you agree with that? I don't, I don't know if he calls himself perfect in the English. Um, absolute. Let's let's use the words absolute. absolute yeah. um, I mean, obviously, obviously, he the things he has made reflect who he is, and so the way the the way the natural world operates in harmony, yeah, total harmony in a universe, yes, you know, that is finely tuned. Mm -hmm. um, he, um, you know, whether he, whether he wants to be. Uh, much more perfect than that. Correct. When, when I say more perfect than that, the original creation was, if you believe it, uh, which I do. Yeah. You know, the Garden of Eden, things were how they. Let, let's not talk about revelation right now. Okay. Let's not talk about revelation. Okay. Let's talk about what qualities would we attribute to this creator. So this creator must be perfect at all Fair times. Must be all knowing at all times. Well, must perfect, be all powerful. Perfect, so. Do you believe that we're perfect? No. Well, so not, what about not. the so what about the creator who created us? Can he be imperfect or perfect? He must be perfect. Well, yeah. Do you agree with that? It's an assumption. But it's not based on um, knowledge. Okay, but based upon based upon your 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 natural instinct and based upon using our sound intellect, we can't you can't attribute to the to the higher being with deficiencies with weaknesses like we have. For example, God doesn't sleep, we sleep. Yeah, God doesn't experience fatigue. God doesn't, uh, doesn't experience, um, he doesn't need to go to sleep. Why do we sleep? Because we need to rejuvenate ourselves. And that's a, that's a deficiency, that's a weakness that you, cannot, you can never ascribe to the creator. So, no, you don't have to see him, but, but from, your, from your, based upon the first principle, we both believe that there must be a higher being. That higher, that higher being, that qualities and attributes that he has must be much more powerful and much more knowledgeable than any of his creation. It must be all powerful and all knowing. The, the problem I have yeah. is that I think I'm looking through the lens of a human. And when you say that, when I use the word perfect, we're talking about a spiritual being who's on another level. I wouldn't use the word spiritual being because even spiritual being is a creation. Yeah, spirits or demons, right? But we're, talk, we're talking about God. No, no, no. Let, let's not use. Let's not use the revelation. Okay. Let's use from up, based upon what we understand who the Creator is. So this Creator, from natural inclination, you know, the Creator must be all powerful. The Creator must be all knowing. The Creator must be all knowing. Must be all all wise. Do you agree with that? Well, must must. So, yeah, okay. Do you believe that? The, do you believe that Creator is sustaining the universe? Providing us, yeah. yeah, okay, brilliant. So why do we put this litmus test to his creation, including Jesus? Does Jesus meet this criteria? He wasn't going to mention faith. No, but no, no, no. First is common agreement. See, we both come to common agreement about the Creator. The Creator must be one and only. Correct. The Creator must be right. Okay, fine. But the Creator must be all powerful. Was Jesus all powerful? He came with the authority. But even, but he was given the authority. So how can God, as the Almighty, how could he be the recipient? How could he, how could he receive authority when he himself is the Almighty? Do you see what I'm coming from? If Jesus is all powerful, he already had it. But by the Father. The Father gave him the authority. And we believe in all the prophets, they were given uh, some sort of authority from Almighty God. That does not make them God, correct? 
Well, yeah? I mean, we've got, we can't avoid going back to the... Uh, we're already back there. What we, what we are discussing right now is, the, is, is what is the criteria? Who is God? Let's define God. And right now, I'm not even using Islam, Christianity. I'm using what we call intellect, rationality. That you know this creator must be all-knowing. How can you attribute this all-knowing attribute to his creation? Why not? Because we agree, we both agree, that the creator must be all-knowing and his creation are ignorant. But, but do, you think, do you think it's a possible plan that he would put his power into a, a human being? So look at, okay, good. So look at your phrase. Do you, do you think it's possible that the creator must give some sort of power? You just said that. Okay. When, now I'm going to use your Bible. Now let's talk about Revelation. Let's see if Jesus meets the criteria that we both believe about God. When you read the story of Jesus uh, bringing Lazarus from the dead, you, are you familiar with the story? Bringing Lazarus from the dead? Yeah. Okay. I think it's mentioned John chapter 9 or something like that. I'm not yeah. sure. What did Jesus say? Let's have a look. Yeah, sure. Jesus prays to the Father and he says, Father, I think that you hear me. I know that you always hear me. Yeah? You can bring up the passage. Now, prayer, can we agree that prayer means you're asking for help? You're in need? Sometimes. So when you pray, does that show that you are in the help of the Father? My prayer might be thanking him. No, no, no. Prayer by definition means uh, you are in need, correct? No. So, God, does God pray? Might do. Don't know. Is, God, is God in need of anything for him to act? Or do we human beings need to ask God for help? See, I, I want you to really reflect upon this because if we both agree that, Jesus, uh, that God is all-powerful, why would Jesus ask the Father for his prayers to be accepted so that he can perform, so that he can bring Lazarus from the dead? Think about it. Yeah. I mean, I would, I, would, I would call Jesus the Son of God. No, no. The son, not, the, son, the, the, son, the Son of God is a separate discussion. Or we, we can talk about that. Well, but let's, but let's stick to the... Jesus calls himself. I mean, we're, call, we're calling yeah. him this or that. He calls himself No, no, this. Right, no right now... Right now, what we're discussing about is, does Jesus meet the qualities of the Creator? He did it himself. Sorry, can we... Do you, okay this gentleman here me? does this all the time. No, and, no, and, and, no, and I'm being honest with you. I've been here with him. No, you're lying. No. No, I've been here with you. Why are you lying? It's recorded. Where? Where? When, when did I discuss this with you before? Do you want me to bring the video? You want me to bring the video? He's afraid of me. He doesn't want me to Basically, tell him David, that he's, you know, da David, 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 I, I he want to. He goes to people, he thinks he David. can uh, overpower in a way like a word. So he just said. So he just wants he to just do said, that. Because if I tell him something, so David, he doesn't want to hear it. D David, you know, he, because yeah. Jesus said that yeah. he's going to raise himself from yeah. the dead. Yeah. He said, you know, yeah. bring this temple down, I'll raise, I will raise it. He didn't say God will raise it. J he said, I will raise it in three days, not by hand. David, but that, David, so this gentleman said, here. Sorry. My name is Alvin. He, David. Yeah. He's, David, nice to meet you. Alvin. Listen, my friend. No, no, this gentleman here just said he's never spoken to me. And no, I'll no. show you. I haven't I'll show spoken you. to you about this before. Oh, I've now you're changing. You. Now you're changing no, 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 the terms. I told you before. No, is, sorry, I can't, I can't speak afraid. to you. Individually. He just can, knows. No, look, can he, we? He looks for people David, that are nice. Da, like David, you. You're a nice David, guy. can we? Uh, okay, no, David, can we? I'm a sinner. I don't seem like. No, no, David, no, 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 no,
you could be just observe, I'll, observe, I'll, I'll observe. observe. Thank you very much. And then we'll carry on because I, I mean, I've got yeah. to go in half an hour. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. Well, nice to meet you. Anyway. Thank you. I, I, I really respect you for your agreeing. Would you Thank discuss you. this with me after he's gone? Yeah, yeah. yeah separately. Oh, yeah? I can. Okay, yeah, great. no problem. I'll, I'll look for you. No problem. No problem. So, where we, were we? Yes. Oh, yeah, we did look at the passage, yeah. didn't we? So, when we pray, what does that signify? It's, commun it's communication with, uh, with the Maker. In return for what? Sorry? In return for what? Well, not, it's not necessarily asking for anything. So, giving him glory. Yeah. That's prayer to me. No, that's praise. That's praise. But prayer, prayer means you are supplicating because you're in need of help. When I say, when for example, I'm in dire need, I say, oh Allah, help me. We've got, we've got a different understanding of prayer, I think. Uh, can we, we can go by the Oxford Dictionary. That, that's where you get wrong. <laughs> so, okay, how do you define prayer? It's talking to our Creator. Talking to the Creator, okay. So, when Jesus prayed to the Father, did, did, yeah, yeah, have a look at the passage. I think it's John 12 or something like that, yeah. Because I don't believe that the Creator has to pray in order for, in order for uh, something to happen. Because God does not require permission from anyone. If he wants to bring someone from the dead, he'll bring someone from the dead. Now a certain man was sick, Lazarus of Bethany, yes. the village of Mary, and his sister Martha. It was the Mary who anointed the Lord. Yes. Right, so that's the context. Yeah. Um, I mean, interestingly here, in this passage, it says Jesus wept. Jesus wept. Now you would say, oh, that shows you he's a man. No, no, no. About the prayer. Why did he pray to the Father? Uh, in order to bring Lazarus from the dead, because God is not in need. If, 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 if God wants to bring someone from the dead, he would do it. But why is Jesus asking the Father? Because he needs help. And you know from our natural instinct that the Creator is not in need of help. He's independent, self-sufficient. Because from Islamic perspective, the concept of God in Islam is God is one and only. God is independent, self-sufficient. He begets not, nor is he begotten. Yeah? And there is nothing like unto him. That's the, that's the pure monotheism. I mean, in this passage, I'm just reading through it. Sure, sure. Jesus says that I am the resurrection and the life. Okay. He who believes in me will live if he dies. Okay. And everyone who lives and believes in me will never die. Yeah. Do you believe this? She said, that's Martha. Yes, Lord, I believe that you are the Christ, the Son of God. Mm -hmm. Even he who comes into the world. Okay. When, when she said this, she went away and called Mary. Yeah. Is this, is this, is the, where's the Lazarus? Where's the, where's the passage about Lazarus? This is all Lazarus passage, yes. So it's a big, it's a big it's a, yeah, it's a big passion. But let's get to the point. Yeah. Right. So, um, I'll read the last bit, which I think you're getting to. So Jesus sure. again, being deeply moved within, came to the tomb. Now it was a cave, and the stone was lying against it. Jesus said, "Remove the stone." Martha, Martha, the sister of the deceased, said to him, "Lord, by this time there will be a stench, for yeah. he has been dead four days." Jesus said to her. Did I not say to you that if you believe, you will see the glory of God? Uh -huh. What does he mean? What does he mean by that? So they removed the stone. The stone. Okay. Then Jesus raised his eyes and said, "Father, I thank you. Yep. You that you that you have heard me. Mm -hmm. I knew that you always hear me. Yep. But because of the people standing around, I said it so that <laughs> they may believe." That you sent okay. He's telling, he's Good. Saying it, not for himself, sorry. Do, so sorry. Did, did we not? Sorry. Sorry. Did, did we not have a meet? So, oh, you're right, David. Right. Did we not have a mutual agreement? I'm talking that, to him. I'm not talking yeah, to you. I think. I think you're right. I'm just though. saying. The words speak right. for themselves. Right. So. I can what, agree with him, right, can't what, I? So what's the biblical language? When it says, "I think that you always hear me." What does that mean? Uh, 
he always hears him. No, but in the biblical language, what does that mean? Why would, okay, Ishmael, you know but Ishmael? But you've got, to use, you've got to finish the sentence, because it says, but, yeah. because of the people standing around, I yeah. said it so. Okay, so how did Jesus raise Lazarus from the dead? By his own power. No, he prayed to the Father. <laughs> Well, to show the people that he's from God. To show that he's not God. No, to show the people he's from God because sorry, they are I, 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 unbelievers. Sorry, now da you David, to David, me, David. Now you open the door. Do you know what? I'm actually going to change. David, David. I'm actually, there, I'm actually, I'm actually going to change my mind. I'm not going to engage with him. Okay. I'm not going to have to say because me. because we, we've had a David. We've just had a mutual agreement that he will not contribute to discussion. I'm not saying he should go away. I'm saying he could listen. You can speak to him afterwards. See, the thing is, you're too nice. Once these people. They're not pro they're do you think I'm nasty? Nice do you think I'm nasty? Like, oh, David, like David, David knows me. Discussion. Before you came to the you park, you just came and you told him that he did that. But he said, "I'm doing it for these people, not because I need your power in order to heal this guy." He has done that before without praying to the God. But Jesus prayed to the Father. Yes, he did to show the people. Okay, he said that. Sorry, and I'm he not. Still ignores it. David, David, he, he, David. Seeing this, don't see. Da hearing, they don't hear. By the way, what's Those your name? What's your name again? Sorry. Uncle Sam. Uncle Sam. Okay, so I'm gonna have some level of respect for you because you're you're older than me. I don't want to, I don't want to shout over you. It's not about my respect. You should have respect for Jesus. Sorry, you don't. No, no, no. No, you don't. No, that, no that's part of etiquette, right? You are saying I'm, Jesus is what lying. I, what I'm doing you're is this. You're saying that Jesus is not God. That's a, that's an insult to my God. David, how long have you known me for? Oh, a couple of years. And how, I don't come out how long have you come here? Up. Go on. How long have you come here? Jesus is God. No, no. Jesus how long have God. you come here? Forever. No, how, how long Forever. have you come here? Jesus is, was there from. I no, know, was Muhammad I, before are, you, are you Jesus? Time? Are you was Jesus? Muhammad before time? Sorry, are you Jesus? Was Muhammad before are you Jesus? Time? I'm here to talk about Jesus, no. not about myself. No, no, no. You're no, here no. to talk about me. I'm trying to make a point, actually. No, no, you're not. You're trying to talk right. to me. So, David, no, I, think, I think we have to move away. We can even do it off the camera. I really don't care. Right? Or, or we can end the discussion and then we can walk away. <laughs> It's anything. up to you. Because I, can I can't, him. I can't have a discussion like that. I'm Sorry. Say, Sorry. You engage me. I can't. I only respond when you Sorry. engage me. I'm gonna end right. the discussion Go here. Go ahead, bro. Yeah. Go ahead. I know you can't I'm discuss with me. No. Why don't you discuss it with me? No. I, I, well, I've actually changed my mind. I, I actually wanted you. No, but you didn't. You didn't. Because you're scared. No. You know that. David, do you want to carry scared. on or should we end? No, he's just a nice guy. He's trying to be nice to you. Put one side. But you don't deserve it. That's the problem. Okay, he does. He does. He does. Yeah. Okay. I'll, I'll go ahead and leave. You guys go ahead. Thank you. Love, Thank your, you. love your neighbor. Because he's, he's so nice. But you know what? These people, they're just making the video. You watch the video afterwards, they're just like, oh, he doesn't know this, he doesn't I know. I know. Yeah, that's what they do. I'm not responsible for the comments. What? Okay, I'm not responsible for the comments. I'm not talking on about YouTube. the comments. I'm not talking about the way you edit and the way you misrepresent the video. Edit, I know, I know these two. Show me one. What? Show me one video where they edit it. You know, do, 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 do you know what's really ironic? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah? I, th th this discussion has been hijacked. And I want to make a point. You are with Soccer Films. You're with DCCI Ministries. And you know what? They made me look like that I was disrespecting Jesus. And you know, we as Muslims, we don't, look, we may have differences of opinion, they edited the video to make me think that I, I disrespect Jesus. Giving that, giving us a, the giving us a of the, 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 the video. All right, I'm gonna, said, I'm gonna end the discussion the hadith, here. I'm gonna end the discussion here. Because later on, he's denied it from that. So they do it's, up to, it's up to you, David. If you want to engage, if you want a one-to-one, -one, we can all. chat there. You guys do that. Otherwise, we'll end Just, the discussion. I'm gonna leave you if you want to go ahead with it. Sorry, Sam. Oh, do I carry on? Or do you to go? I've got a question. I had a question, but you have to come back to my room. Stop or continue?